can't see the baby's apartment below. So what do you want me to do about it? You want to call the police? You call. You're the one that heard it. Don't the baby check him to the hall, see if there's anything out there. What's going to be in the hall? I just thought maybe you should check. There's nothing to check in the hall. Anything to see would be behind the door. There's no point to the hall. The hall has nothing. Okay. If you think you heard an actual gun, if you're certain of it, then make the commitment and call the police. But don't say you're not sure and make me get up and go to the hall. That's not what I'm here for. I'm not interested in that. Okay. <laughs> I just have this funny feeling. Yeah, you always get paranoid in the middle of the night. <laughs> if it were a gun, then there'd be people yelling. There'd be commotion, right? Maybe it was just a car making backfire on the street. Or maybe I can't knock a book over someone's cell. You think that's it? Yeah. That's probably it. Bobby, ah. hold me. <laughs> Sorry. the beats for? Because I love you. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> I love that even though you were sleeping, this picture part of you is still awake, working to keep you alive. I think that's a miracle. <laughs> Don't you? Come on, Lynette. I gotta get up early. Bobby, when you have to pee in the middle of the night, do you ever think about your own death? No! While I was sitting on the toilet, I touched the top of my knees and I thought about how something Someday, everything will be lighted away and there will be only be bones there. And there will be no point to saving my legs anymore. <laughs> there will be no fear or visitors to support the hair. And it occurred to me that even the act of urination is not whatever kind of thing. It's something I should treasure. Because someday, my brother will turn to death. <laughs> Breathing. This is also special things. Lungs are not forever. Someday there'll be two dried sponges. Shit, Lynette! Shit! I know. I Three know. hours I, I got to get up. I'll be fucked if I don't get my sleep. I know. Good to sleep. I want to sleep tonight. Stop. Good <laughs> 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 whisper. Never mind. All right. Are you still in love with me? Why are you asking me this? Because usually when we spoon, you get a boner. <laughs> <laughs> So I to go to a bar. Was this like a few minutes ago this happened? Yes. I thought I had a gun. Was that you? Yes. You know, I knew there was something. I told Bobby. I said to him there was a definite shot. So that was you. That was me. I was going to call the police. Should I call the police? It doesn't matter anymore. Who oh, you? My brother, Ori. <laughs> oh my God, you have a brother? <laughs> I was making love to his wife. <laughs> well, that wasn't a good, smart thing to be doing. Couldn't be helped. <laughs> Lola and me, we fell in love when we were 15. 
Really? So this has been going a long time then? Yes. Me and Lola, we grew up in the same village in Puerto Rico. Ooh, I hear Puerto Rico is a nice place to vacation. Is it nice there? Eh? Like a paradise. Uh, mm -hmm. I've always wanted to see the island. But Bobby, he's no traveler. No. But you and Lola, I want to hear about. You met on the island, you were so mates. Go on. The first time we made love, <laughs> it was siesta time. We walked down the street. Everyone was asleep. Everything was quiet except for the waves flipping over very soft. It was hot. <laughs> Just a little windy from the ocean. Very sexy. <laughs> I took her down to the shade of a vanilla bean tree. We lay on the bank. She opened her blouse for me and her skin. <laughs> Smell sweet just like the tree. After we made love, I cried. I do that too! I cry after Bobby and me make love. So you cry too. Oh yes, it is because when I make love, my heart leaves my body for heaven. And when it is over, my heart has to come back. It is very sad. <laughs> my clang thing is a little different. When I make love, my heart leaves my body. I'm always expecting to meet Bobby's heart outside his body. <laughs> but Bobby's heart, well, Bobby has a hard time opening up. If you met his own family, you'd understand. His heart doesn't really leave his body, so my heart is out there. All along, waiting for Bobby finish up. He will sleep. I'm still out there, floating and feeling very lonely. And then I cry and wake Bobby up, and he gets annoyed. But it's not to say that I don't get a lot of other things from him. Yes. So how come Laura didn't marry you? Her parents said, Laura, marry Jorge. He made better money than Esteban. Ah, that's not fair. That is life. Oh, yeah. He ran a taxi service to the airport. Huh? I've been working for him. Almost limo. I had to fly. I see my own this way and fly. See, when I drive someone to the airport, I always say to them before they get out, have a safe trip. God bless. Now one of my passengers have died in a plane crash. It's part of the service. <laughs> That's nice. So, do you know where you're going? Is anyone going to be meeting you? Like, do you have a grandparents or anyone going to take you over to the other side? No, all my family is still alive. Are you Catholic? Yeah, I grew up that way. Do you think the Virgin Mary will be there? I don't know. Did you go through a tunnel and see a white light? <laughs> no, I haven't even left the building yet. <laughs> <laughs> to be scared. It's nature. Everything dies. Chickens and dogs and pussycats and movie stars and cockroaches and grandmommies and guys like me who drive people to the airport. We all gotta do it. So how can we, that something that everybody has to leave, be so bad? But you think there's something to go to? You think there's something else? Sure. Why not? Bobby says all the stuff is bullshit. When you die, you die. Oh man, don't listen to him. How can a guy who can't even make good love know anything about the afterlife? Jeez, no wonder you're such a scared lady. I didn't paint your fair picture. He's a very good person. What's your name? Lynette. Ah. Lynette. Lineta, <laughs> tu eres muy amable y muy hermosa. Deseo que tú puedas pesarte y tener sus senos en mis manos como si fueran frutas perfectas que las hayas frías para comer. What did you just say? You are very kind and beautiful. I wish that I could kiss you and hold your breasts in my hands as if they were the perfect fruits, too beautiful to eat. On the man, you think. He says to put your hand on his chest. <laughs> That's as far as you go with that. <laughs> 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 <laughs>
Escucha la música. Este es el expulsado este corazón después de todo se va. This is what you hear between heartbeats. After everything else is gone. <laughs> Jesus. It took her to the shade of vanilla bean trees. 